Uh, hey guys, how you doing? My name is Art, and welcome back to the beginning of the new week. I don't have much this week because of, um, it was a light week for me anyway, so, but this is the beginning of no Marvel books in my pull in my pull box in my comic store. So the only thing I'm gonna have is technically Image, which uh, is the only other thing, and maybe some Dark Horse or IDW. <laughs> so basically, you know, my that means I go I have to go to other stores to buy my books. But anyway, so here we go with uh, Bounty Hunters number twenty four. It's been two years. Two years since this book started. And I'm thinking about cutting this one off. I'm just thinking about it. King Spong number 11. Radiant Black. 15. I was looking forward to this Blood Syndicate number two, Fantastic Four forty four, and the last book, Captain America: Sentinel of Liberty number one. Really looking forward to this. Picked up some Fantastic Four books. Number 262. Really like that cover. 264. 266. I really like this one. Uh, 273. 278. I have this one already. 278. 281. This is the reason why I bought this. But the funny thing is, I got this book already. I bought it maybe a year ago. Totally forgot. 283, I believe. Yep. And of course, 284. 285. And my third 286 in the past two years. Gunko from G.I. Joe. Back in the day, I used to collect G.I. Joe figures like the Dickens when I was a kid, back in the 80s. Most of those, you can buy those figures now off of eBay for maybe from, ranging from like three bucks to 60 to 70 dollars, sometimes with weapons, sometimes with not. This is a new reintroduced line that they've been doing re the last couple of years or so, and Gunko is one of my favorite ones. This is how I learned about the 203 combo from. I think it was the 203 combo. What I no, I didn't hear it from it. Yeah, I did. Where you had a you no know, M16 with a grenade launcher on a face on the bottom of it. Really cool figure, gung ho. And uh, a friend of mine got me this. This pop right here of. Papa Emeritus the first for the band Ghost. It's really cool. I'm gonna put this in my office. I'm gonna take this to the office. And last but not least, we have Thor. The figure Thor figure from the Love and Thunder. Uh, this is from the uh Korg Builder figure wave, which the movie comes out in the next couple weeks. So far, I Roger Richard Thor, which I wanted. Just got this one, Thor. Now I'm looking for Valkyrie and the Mighty Thor, and I'm done with this whole mess. And I'm done with this whole wave. Those are the ones I want. And with that being said, that is it for the week.
Yes, I know. Um, like I said before in my last comic book review video that might not have that much going on this for the next couple of weeks or months, who knows. Lots of things changing. Trying to do this also, this um, live streaming thing. Trying to get this, trying to figure it out so I can actually live stream certain things instead of making videos. Like for example, if I'm playing a video game, I can live stream me playing a video game to a certain extent, or I could oh, sorry, or with my hero clicks I'm want to try I want to try to live stream those instead instead of trying to make it a video, I just live stream it and boom be done with it to create different types of content. but anyway. With that being said, I want to say thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I do plan on talking about another video in a minute or so. Not exactly sure when I'm going to do it, but sooner or later I will. Like, naturally. But anyway, with that being said, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate you watching this, and I'll see you in the next one.